What's up guys, I got CS2, so naturally what did I do first? Load up Inferno and go to B and try to figure out all the nades. So, I mean, I'll go over everything at Inferno that I've found so far. I've only played for a few hours, but, you know, something. It's something. Um, the new CT lineup from Wogs is, you know, in front of Wogs. You can aim at the corner of the building here while crouched and then left click. And that'll smoke CT very nicely. Now, there's another lineup from over here by this panel. You just gotta aim at the top of these uh, windows right here. Or is it these ones? Uh, one of these fucking windows. That window. And left click. It's a little off center, but with how smokes work in this game now, they expand so much, it'll, it'll cover. So it's still fine, even though it's like way off to the side. And again, you gotta worry about people on that boost. Now I've found one coffin smoke so far. You're gonna get into this green panel over here, the gas panel, and you're gonna find this middle beam in the construction, and then aim up on the second wire where this little light is, and then you're gonna left click throw. It's gonna bounce nicely and slightly deeply into a uh, coffin. This is kind of a concern, but it should be pretty easy to spam if you are concerned. All right, you come through here, just give that a go. Um, I know there should be a better way to smoke this. It'll probably have to land like right here or something, but um, you know, that's what I found so far. So if you guys find something better, let me know. I saw this on Reddit. You can molly you box by standing in the same corner as you would before. And all you have to do is aim at this little metal thing that sticks out, I believe, and left click, and it's just gonna land right on new bucks. And hopefully mollies don't become inconsistent because, you know, I threw it there and it looks fine. I'll throw it again, and it looks like it spreads similarly each time, but, uh, you know, that I'm still concerned about it. So we'll remember that one for now. The only molly for dark that I've found so far is standing on top of half wall in front of this big circly thing. Um, you can kind of see there's like a two brown spots on the wall here. You can aim to the, inside the right one and then up until you're in the gap between the wooden boards and take a small walking step forward and throw. really small walking step forward and throw and it should cover everything including pillar, emo pillar. Um, um, on the CT side of things, I found an interesting nade set. If you hug this back wall here as you're coming into B, uh, just leave yourself enough distance away from this building right here. And if you aim at the bottom orange part of that cone, you can throw a smoke and then a molly jump throwing of course and you'll get a smoke that should land something like this it's going to give you a good amount of space to take control um usually that smoke lands a little further but you know it is what it is if you're a coffin player you can come to this corner here and if you just look at the top left of the windows right there you can actually just re-smoke the front of b for yourself so that's also pretty neat um, as a CT, if you're roting, ro roting, rotating towards A, you can hug this back wall here and just aim at this middle wooden bar right there and left click a molly. Um, usually it spreads into both of this corner here for the pit plant and the back corner. Um, this one is actually a molly that I've found to be a little inconsistent, but you know, give it a shot and see how it goes. You know, you can, I should explain, you can also kind of step off to the side a little bit. Don't be seen from graveyard, of course, but you can step off to the side and then also aim similar, similarly, and you'll get a roughly equal Molotov. Now, I've been trying to figure out smokes that will fly across the map to land here. Just like how in the very old version of Inferno in CSGO, where you could just like constantly resmoke banana, 
this one is inconsistent for me, but maybe someone can figure out what I'm doing wrong. Uh, you can come into this corner here in arches. Aim in between this and this wooden beam right there, and then up until you're at the height of the tree to the right. So like at the height of this thing right there. So in between these two, you're gonna aim up until you're at the top of the tree and then jump throw. Now in an ideal world, it's gonna land relatively nicely and be centered. Uh, that one actually worked out okay if you let the smoke bloom for a split second longer. Um, but for some reason, when I try to rethrow the smoke, I don't get a consistent um, lineup. For a moto smoke, you can kind of stand where this crack on the wall is. It's also where like this, you know, it's right here where it kind of like goes lower, the little shit. I don't know how to describe it. You aim at this little thing here on the roof in the back and then you aim up until you're right there. It's like one, two, three. You can see these tiny little things that are sticking out of the roof. Um, aim about that height and I'll give you a pretty good mono smoke. This is boostable or you can boost over it and see apartments. Just keep that in mind. Um, but overall if you're coming out lane this should be pretty good for you. Now, if you've played a lot of Inferno, you've probably learned this old entry flash that you used to do running off of uh, running up porch, you'd bounce it off the wall here. Your frame of reference is going to be to the left of this brick right here, this gray brick. So as you come out this way, you're going to swing, aim to the left of the gray brick, and then just run and jump throw. And as you come out, that flash is going to pop in sight, and obviously you can run with it. So. Full speed, let's just pretend you were just like straight up going, something like that. It's our entering site. Last little thing is this retake or repeak for mid um, from the port side. You gotta be a pit player, you're gonna stand between the barrel and the rock here, or the bricks. You just gotta aim at the tip of the roof way back over there. Oh, this one works, nice. Um, just aim at the tip of the building right there and left click. And it's going to perfectly bounce. The tracer doesn't really show it, um, or that thing, but you can see I'm going to hold a really thin angle, and I am blind as shit. So obviously if you're like a little closer up, or maybe you're in boiler, you know, you're just going to get full blind. Um, so I think retaking mid or repeaking mid with flashes on molly is going to be really good in CS2 as it was in CSGO. So keep this flash in mind as you play Inferno. Uh, that's all I have so far. Um, I'm sure other people will find other stuff, but this is what I have found in the hour-ish, hour, two hours that I've been playing Inferno. So, hope you enjoy, and let me know if you find something pretty interesting, and I'll take a look and maybe showcase it in a future video. Thanks for watching, and like the video if you like the video.